Hi all. So, speak life to the problems and and the opposite to Satan. That's the title. So, so I've done a video like this, but I'm doing I'm, I'm merging two together, which is this new video. So I did another video that was called "Speak Life to Your Situation." But if you write down on 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 the search, write down on the search on 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 my, on my video on my channel, just put just type in "Speak Life." And you should find it the other one to this one so so you know whatever circumstance or problems you're going through whatever situation which whatever situations it is, situation it is just just talk to that problem don't talk to God but just talk directly to the problem eventually maybe one or once once in a while you can talk to God about it how you're feeling whilst you're waiting waiting for the for the outcome to happen but then eventually but always it's best to just keep talking to the problem and with the twist of it as well you have to you have to if it if it's a, if it's if it's a demonic thing or 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 the computer or, or your computer is not working or something like that is it that that's running slow sometimes we have to just tell the devil, devil to back off or lie to him, and to, yeah, that's the only person you. That's the only person we need to lie to, and that's the devil. Just say that you know, devil, don't touch my stuff, because I'm gonna destroy it soon. I'm gonna dis I'm gonna destroy it soon. And obviously, you're, you're not gonna destroy it because you won't, because it's your stuff. But you're you're deceiving him to believing that you're going to destroy it. But all in all, you're not really gonna destroy it. But then that that I know you, I know you, I know you guys might, might might find might find this confusing, but that's that's the way how the devil works. If you confuse him by confusing by saying out loud that I'm gonna I'm gonna destroy it, then he shouldn't he shouldn't he shouldn't touch your your product or item or problem, and then eventually he'll he'll back off and then. Whatever it is, the, the whatever it is, or whether it needs healing or not, it will it will come. Whether it needs healing, it will it will be healed by God, by the grace of God. But if it if it if the if it doesn't need heal healing, then the prop then the situation or circumstance will come to come true. Whatever you're praying for, or speaking speaking the life into that situation, the problems. So. That's really all I have to say in this situation. But remember, there are parts in the Bible where it says about where 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 where, where we read in the Bible where 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 Jesus actually just spoke spoke to the problem instead of speaking to God. Jesus 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 literally just spoke to the problem and just commanded it to leave. When 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 especially when especially when when demonic spirits was possessing people. God did um Jesus Jesus just told the told the demon to to just tell the demon to flee or leave especially when 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 the demon was in was in, was in the man and then and then and then the, the then the demons ask 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 Jesus to to go into the into the herd of pigs and then, and then Jesus told told the, told the demonic spirits to do that to go in, go into the pigs and the pigs drowned so it's always good to just do that as well whatever God guides you on as well on what to say but you know don't try and be friendly with the devil at all because you know it's very that's very it's a very dangerous thing to try and do I'll only recommend it if somebody hears if if, if anyone if it, I'll only recommend it if somebody if somebody is diagnosed with a, with a clinical problem which is called psychosis or mental illness hearing voices because when people hear voices that's the demonic spirit talking to them a, a devil a devil devilish spirit but even even with that it's best to just ask God for for direction for that 
or just ask or ask somebody else for direction for that or whatever you what or whatever you believe God is directing you on 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 that circumstances or on that circumstances or what to do with that situation but be guided by the Holy Spirit and God in that situation and circumstance so that's really all I have to say in this video so let me just pray before we finish Heavenly Father we thank you for your grace and mercy that you put upon us Father thank you that for the opportunity to be able to to be able to push back what the devil is trying to hatch against us and plan Thank you for giving us the, the chance to be able to pray, O oh God. And we pray, O oh, oh Lord, that you're able to um that you're able that we're able to be bold and, and courageous in what we pray for, O oh God, as it's as your as your your will is revealed to us, Lord, Lord Jesus and Father. Pray well mainly the Father, but by grace and mercy help us, Father, to understand about speaking life into that situation, O oh God in our situation and circumstances and healing in our situation and circumstances and speaking the opposite to the devil practically just lying to the devil to in order to in order to let in order to let the, the devil and satan let go of your let go of our situation and circumstances and problems that we have into the in into in our day-to-day -day activities father we plead the blood of jesus christ in our situation pray not to fall upon our situation pray hand be upon our situation in the blood of jesus we pray these things all in Jesus' name. We pray, Amen. So God bless you guys, gals. Take care. Bye for now.